Black to score a number one album on the US Billboard charts. And when they split, she just got more successful than ever. So live and direct from the Big Apple, pop star guest number three. Ooh, baby, do you know that's I was born in Hollywood, California, and am currently living in the south of France, but I still travel around the world all the time singing. I grew up loving music, and my first band uh, had no idea how to sing. Um, but my only choice was singing and playing the drums, and I decided to sing, and that's how I started. I ended up being the lead singer of the first really successful all-girl group in the U.S. I went on to a solo career in the 80s and ended up having seven top ten U.K. hits. More recently, I reformed the group that I had originally started with, and I'm currently touring with that group in America. I'm really looking forward to tonight because I love this program. It's it's funny, it's amusing, it's smart, and I'm honored to be performing tonight. It's me. Please welcome the singer with more gold and platinum on her walls than Fort Knox have in their vaults, Belinda Carlisle. <laughs> This, this is not the first time we have had a Belinda Carlisle on this stage. I know. This was a girl called Elaine Rennie, and mm -hmm. she's from North Shields. She was a busker. She was on Series 9. She got into the final. But you did something fantastic for her, and it meant everything to her. And I want you to see this. Fantastic. Do you know what this is? These are the flowers actually sent by Belinda Carlisle. Really? To have this, yes. oh, and <laughs> this is the fact she said. Belinda. She said, best of luck for tonight. I hope you win. Really? Love, Belinda. And that's I love you too. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> oh, wow. And she really does love you. What a nice woman. Yes. Isn't this a lovely person? We know that she we know that she can do the singing, but what about our job? But did we get her right? Capri pants next time. Oh Capri <laughs> pants. Yeah. But she looked she had the, the bustier down, she had the scarf down. She had it was a great job. She did a great job and I was very flattered when, when I when I saw her do it. It must be even odder being on this stage about to be somebody else. Oh yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes it is. Uh, well, uh she was born in New Jersey in 1938. She was the original Italian-American queen of pop and also the best-selling female artist of the 50s and 60s. Do you have a connection with this woman? Well, she was one of my favorites. I grew up listening to her records. Does that date me? Uh, hardly <laughs> at all. Her 45s. And I can't believe that, that you're going to make your son so proud tonight. Oh. Tell us, Belinda, who you're going to be. Tonight, Matthew. I'm going to be Connie Francis. Connie Francis! <laughs> from punk chick to drum queen tonight, singing live, Belinda Carlisle is Connie Francis!
from. Thank you. That transformation <laughs> is <laughs> astonishing. Like the wig? I love <laughs> the wig. How does that make you feel when you look in the mirror dressed like that? It makes me want to cut my hair like this. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. said you were very flattered when you saw somebody doing you. I think Connie Francis will be very, very oh, flattered by that well, thank performance. You. Ladies and gentlemen, Belinda Carlisle as Connie Francis! <laughs> Let's just say that one more time for Linda Carlisle as Connie Francis. I can't believe I just said that. Usually, this show is about revealing a hidden talent.